I've had this idea of making a centre hole finder for my milling machine. So I came up with this little idea. Uh, that goes in the hole. And I've made various lengths of these. This just unscrews. You can put different lengths in. And basically all it does is it converts horizontal motion to vertical motion. Like that. That goes in a 3 8 collet in the spindle of your milling machine. So as that goes around in the hole, if the hole's uh, not central then it makes the um, that part go up and down. And obviously you just put a, uh, a DTI on that surface there. And the DTI can then be in one position. And uh, it gives you no absolute measurements but uh, you can then centre the hole just by altering the X and Y axis on the table to get a minimum reading on the DTI. Um, it's all pretty straightforward machining. Making sure that uh, all this was done in one operation to make it concentric. And um, it's all pretty straightforward. Made out of, most of it's made out of stainless and brass. I'll um, put it in the milling machine and give you a quick demo. I've mounted the sensor finder now in my milling machine using a 3 8 of an inch collet. So <coughs> I've eyeballed it and made it roughly in the middle. So if I switch it on now, you'll see the DTI going up and down, so that's actually going up and down. So all you've got to do is just bring the X and Y axis in and out of it until you get the minimum deflection of the DTI. I'm just moving the Y axis. So basically it's just converting any horizontal motion into vertical motion so the DTI can be fixed in one position. Thanks for watching the video, hope you found it interesting and see you next time.